will start this rally. Dumakulangan setting it up to Pat Santos, who I'm expecting to have a bounce back season. Wow, you will expect a lot from a lefty spider at God. Ang hirap i block niya. At ang kita natin dito, nabigyan ng isa Janelle Rica Blanca. And I like that na na activate agad yung rookie. Yes. Marasiga going up for the spike and. Nang mapuwa. Lady Cardinal. And this is also a very young team. Their yes. core is mostly sophomores and juniors. And now San Sebastian giving Mapu a taste of their own medicine with that block. And the first step is always the warm-up of both teams. So kung sino yung maganda yung panlikod sa corner, kaya mahirap din depensahan niya ng libero. Bohol. Combination play. Okay. What a great set there. Iba na rin kapag matagal na rin yung setter mo eh. Yung, yung mga ganyang classing play kasi it's really hard to... Of what Coach Roger, Roger said, totoo yan. Medyo kulang sila sa reception because they they yeah, lost a good libero, si, si Jewel Vermilio. So, importante din na meron kang matatag na libero. Kasi yung mga liberos, they're the ones who are organ... Yung i-receive lang namin yung position namin. You also organize the defense of the team. So we are taking a look at the very young rookie libero from San Sebastian, Floyd Florenci Lazarte. So yan, yan ang, uh, yan ang ginagawa ni Melissa Gohing. Back in the day and perhaps tells us na malalim yung rotation and also these players, especially the new ones, are ready to contribute right away. Yes, and this is their first gaming also yung mga players from the bench. We are seeing Garcia and Rica Blanca from Mapua contributing right away. Now for San Sebastian, it's the usual suspects, just like Tina Marasigan as we see here. And outside spike. So kailangan nakaposisyon ka talaga paatras. If you're not in a good position, you won't be able to get her spike. Her scoring dip last season as compared to her rookie year. Last season, she was only putting up 12.9 points per match. In her rookie year, she was the top scorer in the league. Oh, back row attack. We love to see back row attacks, especially from young players, rookies, and sophomores. Oh, Mabua. Supposedly, it was a solid block, but nag net touch. Nag net after. Nang gigit. So, laki bagay, no? Na now these kids playing in Taraflex, although it's been like a decade already since diba, they implemented the Taraflex type of uh, yes. type of court. Balik ang bola dito sa San Sebastian. Di makulangan. Setting it up. Kat Santos popped up by Ong. Gohol tosses it up to Super Roxy De La Cruz. Medyo malayo yung set, but De La Cruz was able to, you know, adjust. And then, na nakuha pa niyang ilagay dun sa front line na cross. And that's really hard na to, for, for, for the, for the outs on Sebastian ngayon. Di makulangan. Tossing it up. Bohol, back set. Wow. It's so hard to block a lefty from the opposite side. Raisa Janelle Rica Blanca breaking down the wall. Yes. But their team, though, down by seven here in the opening set. Bohol to Papiera, popped up by Marasigan. Di makulangan. Tossing it up to Santos. Both teams have the same numbers of unforced errors, but yung nga lang, from the Mapua side, mas na utilize nala yung offense nala, and they converted and they're having a hard time with their defense and their reception. So hindi nila na ko convert yung offense nala into points. Like, layu, like for example, that layu yung mga set. Yun, pag patigit yung set, they can convert in this set. 
Coach eyeing Esteban, that's what he's looking for. And coming off that timeout, you go to their best spiker, Roxy De La Cruz. Soaring in for the kill. Gabi din yung upping sa ere, ang tagal ng hang time niya sa ere. Kaya din nahihirapan din yung blocker sa kanya. And this is the matchup right here, Melissa. Other spikers na nila, um, two points. Para hindi, hindi din mapagod yung dalawa. So doon nagkakatalo, no? Yes. But right now, they are going almost exclusively to Roxy De La Cruz. And she is showing us that she is looking yeah. like she's gonna take her game to another level. Get great. <laughs> so hindi na nila ako kailangan. Kaya na nila yun. And, and uh, another thing your team was very known for was dishing two very important things for volleyball success. And iba talaga pag may advantage sa height, especially sa net, because that's the first defense um, sa net talaga. And iba pag may solid blockers ka, because magiging organized din ang defense ng team. Marasigan. A lot of power behind that Gina, spike. Marasigan. Going from open spiker to middle blocker. It's, I always say, so I always ask then, sa mga nagko-convert na players ng position, like, how do they adjust? And some players nahihirapan, but some of the players then, you know, they just, um, they just train for that position, and especially now na may, na teams have coaches na for middle blockers, for per position. So, uh, it's great na very versatile. Si John, si Jonisho, si KJ Jonisho, kasi you don't know. Um, pwede siyang be outside pa kailangan siya. Pwede siyang because KJ is tall. Yeah. No choice siya but to convert her. Yes. When they are timely, calling them at the right time, they matter so much to the way the game is running. And Kat Santos with a miss hit. Mapua will take the opening set here in their opening match of season 99 of the NCAA. We'll be back for set number two. Gives Nagulat Dao. Perpetual in particular, Nagulat moving from this venue to the much bigger venue, the Phil Oil. Fran Garcia. Like what you've said, uh, Anton, totoo yan. nag adjust ka rin kasi like the height of the court and yung laki ng court. But not on crucial <laughs> moments. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm glad you stressed that, Melissa. Pero uh, yun nga, we give a little bit of leeway to the freshmen. Or, or froshies as uh, Lasallians would call them. Kat Santos. Kat Santos. Getting the point in. And then down the line. Mautak talaga siya na player. De La Cruz challenged at the top La of the net. The lady and, and I like how Dimakulangan is also very active on the block. Speaking of Dimakulangan, consistent from the back line. And to me, the player that comes to mind is always Gretzel Soltones. Yes. And grabe ha. Like, um, based from my experience, <laughs> na depends on the backline attacks niya. Para frontline Anton. <laughs> and during her San Sebastian days, grabe talaga. Yes. These days, yung mga Gen Z, they call those types of players mamaw. Serving now is Roxy de la Cruz. Oh, San Sebastian's libero is pretty tall. Yes. <laughs> Kapansin -pansin, eh. Bas Bas, nice pass, quick attack, and Babiera is feeling it. Babiera. Okay, five four, five five. Chaka, like looking at her right now on the bench of San Sebastian. Parang isa na siya sa pinakabatangkad. Eh. Oh, what a save right there! What a save by the new libero of Mapua. Gina gone. Ganado itong dalawang team, pati yung crowd, kasi yung first match sa men's, nag five sets. So it was a, a thrilling five set match. And now it's carrying over here to the women's side. Let's see this attack combination. So parang namalabas, Melissa, no? It's the rookie libero who's the, who's the receiving libero. Yes. Who a 
side. Garcia. Santos. Pas pas. And oh, yun yung explain mo kanina. Yes. Na minsan, yung libero na yung nagsiset. And that's what pas pas did for De La Cruz. That was on the block. On the block. Trixie Gohol has to know all the variations. First spiker on her squad. But wow. of course, there are spikers wow. like Roxy De La Cruz na no matter what type of set you toss to her, dahil mataas siya tumalon, papaluin at papaluin niya yan. Ang tagal talaga ng hang time niya and yung clip niya sa era. <laughs> I, I'm waiting for her fans to bring back that super Roxy banner. Meron yan eh. Meron siya na fans club na may yeah. season 98. Siguro ano, nagwa-warm up pa kasi first match pa lang. Wow, Rica Blanca. No need for a warm up. She is introducing herself to the NCAA viewing public in her debut match. Uwa. And ang galing ng, ng defense nila sa net ngayon, set. And for a team that Coach Roger describes as lacking in height, that's a good sign. Better yung place nila, better yung defense nila from the side of the Lady Cardinal. Gohol. Wow. wow, that's the most powerful hit we've seen from Aliana Ong today. And Gohol answered my question. <laughs> <laughs> and we see the improvement. Last year, Gohol's ranking wasn't high. She was number seven in the best setter race. So I guess she's taking it upon herself to level up her game now that she's in her third year. And with experience then, magiging magulang na rin yung isang setter. And that's what um, Gohol is showing to us. Gohol, back set para kay Rica Blanca. Di makulangan. De La Cruz, again, working hard from the back row. Wow! What a powerful spike. That's a rookie. Yes. So what more if Garcia will play next year and the next years? She's one of, which is one of the hotbeds for volleyball. Ano bang kinakain ng Matangkenyo? Lipa Batangas. Meanwhile, Kat Santos reminding us who she is. One of our more well-rounded and best spikers here in NCAA Women's Volleyball. Sila sa cross kasi sarado yung cross nila. Santos. Gohol, who will she go to? Goes to the middle to the captain. That's probably the happiest celebration I've seen for Mapua, knowing that it was their captain who scored. The set was too close sa net. So mahirap talaga ilagay sa down the line yun. It will be not over. Wow. Running attack. Okay, that impressed me. KJ Dionisio, looking you, like a middle blocker. You were waiting for that, Anton. <laughs> Ang nakakatakot sa Mapua with regards to yung panapos, Ang daming pwede maging closer sa kanila ngayon. Yes. <laughs> Just like this girl right here, Garcia. And hands down, to their rookies, yung yeah. rookies nila sa 97, still playing now, rookie nila, De La Cruz. So for Mapua to bring in this crop of young players, it's great for their volleyball program. Yes. Kanina, ang ganda ng blocking ng Lady Stags, but now yung Lady Cardinals, bumabaw is in the front line, lumalakas talaga yung block nila. You can see her height, lamang na lamang talaga. And Aliana Ong is one of the best blockers here yes. in NCAA Women's Volleyball. 
Janisho. And now, players active at the top of the net. And Garcia gaining confidence with every point. Remember the name, we'll be saying it a lot this season. Freyan Chanel. If she can add that to her game, no. We might be talking to her, talking about her all the time as an MVP <laughs> candidate. Na. Yes. That level. Na. Kaya lang, this is three straight points para sa San Sebastian, Melissa. It's more of consistency, good start, or yung kapit ng isang team. And kumapit ang point kasi yan, Anton. Mukhang na kumagda time out si Coach Roger. Alam ko na yung sasabihin niya sa kanyang mga players. He's been sounding like a broken record in this game, talking about the errors. Roxy De La Cruz, nakaibabaw sa mga blockers. Mahirap talaga pigilan yan, one-on-one. Ibabaw, yes. Pag single yung block niya, chine-check out niya na. Magulang talaga siya. I remember one of your close friends, si Phil Cayetano. I was gonna say that she's actually... Um, on top of my mind. <laughs> diba? Kasi, uh, naalala ko in one of my interviews with her, sabi niya, pag malaki yung blocker, check out, check out. <laughs> you know yung diskarte niya. <laughs> and alam mo yung shot. And for Mapuwa naman, Mapuwa's doing good, especially their first set. Kaya sabi ni Coach Ayeng, just stick to the system. And wag mawala. Now, what was the most nervous you've ever felt in a match? It's probably my first time na pinasok ako randomly. Okay. I was a rookie. So parang ka, what? Okay, okay. And, and that was the start of your story. And we were up against USP. Wow. Aiza Maiza. Oh. Ang Geta Bakero. Oh my gosh. Was, was Rhea there already? Yes. Oh, that was a powerhouse. Yes. <laughs> Those were the, the glory days. Unforgettable game. The yun yung ano eh, pre social media years. Yes. <laughs> and the OGs know. <laughs> <laughs> That's why it's always nice to bring back an OG here to relive the glory days. And now we are ushering in a new era of talent, and we're so glad to see him. The tradition continue of, yes. of talented young athletes. Continue to elevate the game and bring it forward. And you see the rookie players really performing well and giving a lot of points for their team. New setter on the floor para dito sa San Sebastian. That's Mary Ann Margaret Aguilla wearing jersey number five. So, last year, they had Bea Season, who was their captain and setter. Yes. Ngayon, dalawang rookie setter, Melissa. Ano yung palo natin? Yung palong, may meron tayong objective na patay. Hindi yung i-over lang yung goal. Hindi naman mamamatay ako kung malambot pa sa tissue paper yung palo. Pero one pass lang, one pass, one pass. Basic lang tayo, basic. And that, ladies and gentlemen, was the first banat, coat and coat banat ni Coach Roger. We were waiting for that, Anton. Yung quotable <laughs> quotes. Niya. KJ Dionisio, new season, new role. From open spiker to middle blocker, Marasigan. Pina Marasigan. That was a good down the line hit. And I think them young. De La Cruz. Roxy De La Cruz. I am really impressed. Ito talaga ang bola para mas maging organized yung plays ng Mapua. Yeah, they're a good tandem right now. Si Ivana Basbas and Rebustes. Yes.
Patong. And the rookies continue to contribute for Mapua. Raisa Janelle Rica Blanca. The ladies tag was expecting them. Ala, single block na lang doon eh. Single block hindi pa natin mapalog magpadaanan ng bola. Single block eh. Ina, huwag nang itapon eh. Lalaya, pahap, patapon yung palo niya. Hindi na ipapawan. Puro kayo ganyan ang ganyan sa akin. Hindi ko lang kung makahapon kayo eh. Japanese ka ba? Ganyan na kapag ganyan lang ganun sa akin eh. Another quotable quotes then. Hapun ka ba kanina ka po? Ganun lang ganun. Well, totoo naman. Because kanina pa nire-remind. Naalala ko nung nakaraang season, sabi ni Coach Roger. Parang pinapanood lang ng... Siyempre, he said it in a joking manner. He said it jokingly. Pinapanood na lang yung San Sebastian para pakinggan yung mga huddle niya. <laughs> of course... You know, he wants his players to respond in a positive way. And let's see, they still have time. Kat Santos. There we go. Yun, wag matakot. But there was no call, so it was a point for Pua. De La Cruz. And Mapua is able to finish it. Wow, what a game this game, Anton. Let's take a look at the final play. There's the rookie setter, Dimaculangan. De La Cruz to Gohol. To the captain, Tere Manalo. Finishing the match in emphatic fashion.